Harry Potter, the boy who lived, come to die. Snape, or Alan Rickman, has one of the most difficult voices to impersonate. Agreed. I don't think I've actually... I've seen people try to impersonate him, but I've never seen anybody do it well. There's no one I've ever heard that nails it, and you think to yourself, wow, that is... The closest is actually Brendan or Crumble Scrunch. Yeah, he does a great. Yeah, he's the closest he does a great I've ever Alan seen Rickman. to somebody do a, a good Alan Rickman. No, Alan Rickman's voice is so was so unique. Mm -hmm. Another voice that most people can't replicate well. I've never heard anybody do a very good James Earl Jones. Oh, I have. You have? Yeah. I've never heard a good James Earl Jones. Yeah. I, now, I did hear just the other day a great Gandalf. It oh, was, yeah. It was special. But I've seen a lot of on. people do Gandalf. Too. Yeah. Uh, you yeah, shall for... not pass. No. Gas in this classroom. You fool. Josh. Hey, welcome back to our David Reactions in some corporate. Poked of a toque. Uh, why help the agro? Oh, Who's your favorite Harry Potter character, everybody? Mine is Malfoy's mom. Mm. Everybody's favorite character. We all know. It is known. It is known. Uh, Do you know who's one of my favorite? Who? He's not. He's not my favorite, but he's at the top. Is Dobby? Dobby the house elf. I love Dobby. <laughs> Oh, I love her. I love Hedwig. Hedwig's beautiful. Um, you know what uh, Indrani's favorite show is? Ram 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 Yam. <laughs> what the crap? Ramayan. Ram Yam Ramayan. That's her favorite show. Interesting. Is that your favorite show? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think it was. It's fine. <laughs> um, Hers would be Rom Rudon. Rom Rudon. Rom Rom. Yeah. Of course. No, but this is a, a, a video. I, I think we saw a... Um, is Mahabat and Ramayan different? Yes. They're different, right? Okay. I think we saw the title song for Maharabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhabhab
earlier, the Wall Street Journal had published. It makes an sense. I mean, that's like a, yeah. a fraction of their population. A worldwide streaming binge brought on by the new coronavirus reruns of a 1980s <clears throat> religious drama from a state-run broadcaster have emerged as a surprise hit in India. Quite visibly, the news of the TV show breaking viewership records was a reason of celebration for many Indians, but it appeared that the story failed to interest most global media outlets. Apart from a few... I bet a lot of those actors in that show wish it was in syndication. <laughs> no kidding. the Southeast Asia Center of University of Washington, the story of Rama, about the prince and his long hero's journey, is one of the world's great epics. It began in India and spread among many countries throughout Asia. Its text is a major threat in the culture, religion, history, and literature of millions. Each country in Southeast Asia has created a unique version of the story, as it has become a prominent part of the culture in these regions. Each version reflects the values and beliefs of that particular culture. This has resulted in hundreds of variations of the story of Rama throughout Asia, particularly in Southeast Asia. In Cambodia, the version that is popular refers to Rama as Preariam, and Sita is known as Neang Seda. One of the favorite parts for those in Cambodia is the encounter that took place between Hanuman and Sovan Matcha. In Indonesia, the name of the city of Yogyakarta is a transliteration of Ayodhya. The story of Phra Ram has become the national epic for the people in Laos because it holds so much importance to them. Although Praram is considered a previous incarnation of Gautam Buddha and is regarded as the epitome of moral leadership and a true follower of his dharma. Likewise, Malaysia, Myanmar, Philippines and Thailand have their own versions of the Ramayana as its popularity and cultural legacy go beyond the current geographical borders of India. Hi, I'm Karolina. Since you're here, I would like to suggest that you watch... So that was a little more probably about the history yeah, of more it, about more the history than, than, than of the, the actual Rami show, right? Uh, uh, from what it feels like. But um, uh, it, it wouldn't it wouldn't be shocking. Um, the last episode of Game of Thrones was watched by... I, it was, I, I'd it was 20 way. to 30 million mo people, not no. 12. Um, it was way more than, yeah. <laughs> than that number. But yeah. I don't think it was 77 million. I don't think it was 77 million <laughs> but either. But it, it wouldn't be shocking if that is accurate for if, if just a fraction of India watches. Right. And if it has religious elements, nostalgic elements sure. to it. Sure. I'd I, I wouldn't be shocked if that is the actual number. Right. Uh, at all. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me. Just the sheer magnitude of the size of the population. Yeah. Uh, uh, watching a beloved show, it would be the most watched show. I think show. it's a very... Um, it has like almost like... Um, uh, <laughs> That's my brain trying to work right now. Yeah, brain fry. Um, Speaking of money making, James Cameron is about to have the number one, the number two, and the number three biggest money making films of all time. Oh, well. He, that's Hanuman, isn't it? The monkey? Yeah. Yeah, so it it, <clears throat> it almost. I wonder if it has almost like a um... nostalgia. No, soap opera -ish style um, uh, feel to it. A little bit. No clue. Never seen it. Um, but obviously, it has a lot of religious. <laughs> I think the entire it, thing is the whole a, thing a religious is, yeah. story, right? Yeah, which is probably why it has so many. Uh, one of the reasons it has so many viewers is because it has that religious element. Yeah, uh, to it and transcends. It's it's not just <clears throat> India. It looks like it's all of Southeast Asia, if not all of Asia. Yeah, knows the and loves the the story. So yeah, if you guys uh, watched this or did watch it, uh, let us know if if there's like. I don't know if it has songs. I don't know if it, I don't. I don't know much about it outside of I, I do remember a lot of people talking that in Mahabharat. Bhat. if I say Mahabharat. 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 Which I think we've seen films that have been like retellings of because that um, it's a really popular. It's thing. common. Is it that or it's referenced? In SRK a film. has a film called that, right? With uh, Big B Mahabharat. What is it called? Mahabharat. Is it the? Is it a? Like a different telling of that? No, just a similar, just kind a similar of name. Title. Similar 
not sounding word. That's not the same mm. word. Dyslexic. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you can't have similar words like that for me. Uh, <laughs> anyways, let us know if you watch the show and then other uh, videos that we can react to <gasps> down. Maharabata. Just.